I know that uh, I always respect your opinions when it comes to quarterbacks going into the draft. And uh, I'm prefacing that because I saw where the number one quarterback, according to Chris Sims of Pro Football Talk, is Matt Corral. Right. Ole Miss quarterback yeah. Matt Corral. Right. All right. The floor yeah. is yours. Okay. Uh, you know, again, this is uh, a guy that's got – I knew he was talented. I turned it on. I guess I was a little bit more blown away by his talent than I thought. You know, first thing, I'll just hit you with this, banner statement. He has three – things that he does at an elite level to me that like the NFL is going to look at and go, damn, that's, that's special. First off, his arm is extremely strong. I mean, it's like crazy strong to where you go, man, did he really throw that ball 25 yards out route? And it was like five, five feet off the ground the whole way there. Like you had to almost rewind it to go, wait, did that really do that the whole way there? So big time arm, quickest release in the draft, quickest release, I've seen in any draft since I've gotten to, into this side of the business, Dan, that I would say that. And then as an athlete, quickness in his feet is elite and as good as anybody I've ever seen. His ability to pop around the pocket, you know, get his feet situated and make a throw is phenomenal. Oh, fake a little RPO, boom, hit the feet, get the ball out of his hands. It's as quick as anybody I've ever seen. It's up there with the Rodgers and Mahomes and been able to flick it and do all of that. So I really like him. I do. I think he's a good athlete. He throws the ball on the run. Play action pass is the thing in the NFL right now. He thrives on that. He hasn't put it all together yet, but it's all going in the right direction. I think you couple that with the skills I see in the field. I go, yeah, he's the first quarterback for me. Okay. Is he a top 10 pick? I, I, you know, again, I'm different here, but I sit here and you know what I want to say, Dan? I mean, if two was the number five pick, then yes, Matt Corral is a top 10, top, you know, pick that way. But, you know, again, the off the field stuff goes into that. You know, you hear rumors. He was a little bit of a wild college kid. Okay. whoopity do. I don't care about all that crap. I'm just going about what I see on the field here. Uh, but I, I do think his talent warrants that. Now, you know, is he polished and ready to go this second no you'd have to you know use him in special ways and slowly bring him along but i That's don't think anybody got... is polished I, you know willis no, isn't no. pickett isn't uh pickett pickett's a little more than the rest he's the safest bet i would say like you know he's the closest to a what you would want to say like the mac jones last year he's been in a pro style offense you get to see a lot of that he can really play the position well dan everything is good there's nothing he does great to me. There's, there's his, his great is just that he really knows how to play the position and has a lot of experience. He can make all the throws. He's a good athlete. He's got good size. I don't watch Kenny Pickett ever and go, wow. Oh, wow. He does that. Oh my gosh. I love that. I don't ever say that with Corral and, and Willis. I do say that. And I would say, yes, I think Corral and Willis, their ceiling is mm. higher than somebody like Kenny Pickett. All right. 